ago, my life was pretty normal. I lived in the greatest place ever. Brooklyn. Represent. Had two cool parents and loved all things science and superheroes. Everything changed, though, when my dad was killed in the City Hall bombing. I... I couldn't believe he was gone. But Peter Parker and his Aunt May, they were there for me. And so was Spider-Man, who I later found out was Pete. Crazy, right? Then when the Devil's Breath crisis started, things got intense. It seemed like all of Spidey's villains were on the loose. I managed to do my part to help him out. And after all that, believe it or not, a spider bit me. And I started to change. I didn't want to worry my mom, so I went to Pete. And now, we're officially Spider Bros. He's been training me up, and I'm actually getting pretty good with this whole web swinging thing. I'm still learning to juggle this responsibility with everything else in my life. School, friends, a new home. I moved to Harlem a few weeks back. But I'll tell you, I can't wait to see what the future holds. That is so cool. I got you. Hey, thanks. No problem. Hey, uh, you think you're gonna add that new Spider-Man too? The kid? Yeah, uh, maybe. Original's just... My guy, you know? Yeah, I know. Hey, is Tails Bodega around here? Yeah, bright yellow sign down the block. Can't miss it. Thanks. Beautiful work, by the way. Maybe leave a little room for the new guy. Just in case.
cool. Be cool. Helping Spider-Man protect the giant prison convoy? You can handle this. Breathe in, breathe out. Be cool. Pete, you here? Just down in some rocket fuel. How are you drinking? Very, very carefully. Okay, go time. Helix 2 en route, heavy payload. Copy, Helix 2, we've got you all scope. This is a big operation. It's gotta be. Hundreds of felons escaped from the raft last year. Now it's time to move them back in. Police aren't taking any chances, especially not with our guest of honor. Getting a lot of interference here. One of those guys who helped Doc Gock is in there? I think so. Could be Vulture, could be Scorpion, could be someone bigger. Okay, we got a problem. Hold back, Miles. Let me take... I got this beat. Don't worry. Oh, no! <laughs> it's secure. You're drifting Helix 2. We have a weighted balance. Direction 2, 3, 6. Rotors are responsive. Brace for impact. Helix 2, going down. Helix 2 is going down. Casualties. Payload compromised. Response team dispatched. Sit tight, Helix 2. Peter, I'm sorry, man. I, I didn't mean to. It's okay. We got this. Just need to contain it before. Before that happens. Hello, tiny spider. Oh, 
I can hold out a little longer. He's counting on me. I've got to stop these guys. Exchange for new one. Oh. This one will do. Miles, get out of here. Bro. Back the hell. Oh. 
You alive? Kinda. Guys? Wow, just... <laughs> wow! Simon Krieger, head of R&D at Roxxon Energy. Pleasure to meet you. You too. Uh, sorry. I think our ball landed in your yard. No. You actually did us a favor. We uh, just bought the place. Uh, we're planning to tear it down for a build. But it uh, looks like you beat us to it. I wanted to thank you. Both of you. Taking down Rhino? Solo? <laughs> you are going places, bud. Thanks. But he, he's still dangerous. Nah, we'll hold him for the police. You know, I always think these super troopers are overkill until mm, something like this happens. Oh, duty calls. Hey, uh, really great to meet you both. <laughs> Future's looking bright. Hello. Hey. He's right. Yeah. Let's clear out. Let the police do their job. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Bioelectricity. Wow. Gotta be honest. A little jealous. Hey, look. I got nothing on the OG. Think we should run tests tomorrow? A little voltage analysis? Oh... Man, yeah, sorry. I've been meaning to tell you, I'm not gonna be around for the next few weeks. Is some kind of pee joke I don't get? No. Uh, MJ's headed overseas for the Bugle and requested me as her photographer. Kind of a working vacation for us. Oh, man. Look, I don't know if I'm ready to fly solo. I screwed up today big time with the helicopter. But then you delivered big time. You saved my bacon, Miles. I got lucky. Hey, I did this gig for eight years without backup, and you better believe I screwed up lots of times. But that is how you learn. What's this? Christmas present. But first, you gotta take the oath. Oh. Um, okay. I promise to do everything in my power to protect this city. I promise. That's it? That oath a real thing. Totally. Definitely didn't just make it up. See you in a few weeks, Spider-Man. New York's only Spider-Man. I'm New York's only Spider-Man. It's only Spider-Man. Please don't screw this up. Yo, Genki. Dude, Rhino? What? <laughs> yeah. Where you at? You get into the apartment okay? Yeah, your mom let me in. Unpack slash dumped my stuff all over your floor. And now I'm in the park, grabbing some air. Oh, perfect. Dip over to the amphitheater. Got something to show you. Dude, is this fighter related? Please tell me you got a piece of Rhino's horn or something. Pics I've seen of the fight are straight up nuts. Ha, <laughs> definitely spider related. And definitely better than a horn. Oh, loving the suspense. I'm there.
think he's probably waiting at the amphitheater for me. I will never get used to you doing that. Hey, look. Check it. Christmas present from Spider-Man. Open it. <sighs> Dude. Put it on. I'll cover you. Oh, what? <laughs> never seen a guy change clothes in Central Park? Okay. How's it looking? Miles Morales, congratulations and welcome to your very first super suit. Head uptown for part two of this amazing gift. This is only half of the present. What's the other half? I'll let you know when I find it. Just the facts, with me, your truth-slinging host with the most, J. Jonah Jameson. What? Does Pete said his suits the autoplay Jameson show? Guy's a masochist. Bad news, listeners. My Christmas charity spectacular was canceled due to masked vigilante mayhem. Gotta be something better on. Uh, been hearing good things about this one. Hello, I'm Danica Hart, and this is The Danicast, where I spotlight the people making a real difference in us. Today's topic? Oh, you know, stockbrokers, for-profit colleges, who make internet videos autoplay. <laughs> no, obviously we're covering the Spider-Men's incredible takedown of Rhino. Subscribe. Danicast, new favorite podcast. Set up a lot of gear. What? Miles, get ready for your first holographic training challenge. These challenges are spread throughout the city. Each one focuses on a new move or technique. This one focuses on acrobatic improvisation. Get into position to start. Hollow training? Oh, I am so down. First up, air combat. Fighting the enemy on your terms is a great way to gain the advantage. Now follow up with a mid-air attack. And now a personal favorite, the swing kick. This holotech is next gen. With the right parts, but I can make it portable. Think fast. Another key spider skill, disarming. Disarmed opponents are far less dangerous. And it's crazy satisfying to knock guys out with their own weapons. Total twofer. Alright, yeah! This is dope! Bless Peter Parker. Now let's combine these two moves. Make sure you practice the listed move. 
airborne enemies is a great method of crowd control. Plus, the sounds they make are hilarious. Whoa! Land! Blast! Behavior status. Close range combat. Behavior status. Close range combat. Gear we can sell. <laughs> oh crap. Spider! Take them out! Then grab the gear! You all trying to catch some hands? Yeah? Okay, let's go! Take the spider out, then grab the tech gear! We're gonna make bank selling this stuff off! Just so you know, this is official Spider-Man tech! Y'all are not authorized to resell! <laughs> That's it for the tech thieves. Now to fix a training sim. Critical fault on circuit AF-15. Colonel Panic. Well, let's try a BIOS reset. Nice! That did it. it. Looks like P made stealth, swinging, and combat challenges. Gotta check these out when I get a chance. Check out Rockon Plaza on your way home. I just walked by and I'm pretty sure someone's breaking in. Uh, yeah. I'll look into it. Hey, so I want to hear more about your new spider powers. I think it's some kind of bioelectric discharge or supercharged static electricity. Ooh, we got a name about venom power. You know, because it stings. <laughs> okay, that's not bad. I'm gonna run. Plaza first, then home. Remember, Venom Power. Trust me, it's gold. Know the quickest way to end a fist fight? Don't use your fists. In this challenge, grab stuff, spin it around, and whack enemies with it. You can grab objects, enemy weapons, even other enemies. Every hit scores a point. Approach the prompt when you're ready. Let's throw some junk at fake bros. Weapon out of a dude's hands and throwing it back at him? Oh, yeah. speed motion. 
There. Not quite, though. Yanking a weapon out of a dude's hands and throwing it back at him? Go with the reload. Oh, that felt good. Driving and spinning stuff from the environment is a great crowd control move for she does. Extended wind up. Good idea. Hey, friends. Thank you so much for telling people about this podcast. We've jumped the charts from 136 to 87. Like, uh, wow. <laughs> okay, okay. Today I'm doing a quick cast before I head downtown for my citizenship test, and I'm answering fan DMs. First one, where are you from? Well, I was born in Fuzhou, China, but we came to New York when I was six. Next question, what kind of mic do you use? A uh, purple one? I'm just kidding, <laughs> the link's on my phone. Uh, okay, question three, what's the point of your podcast? Okay, so once a week, I get coffee with my friend, a journalist turned lobbyist. We talk about the news, and while we don't always agree, Having to defend what I think makes me prep better. It keeps me informed and gives me a chance to revise my gut reactions. So I thought, what if everybody had that friend? What if I could be that friend for them? That's why I'm here. Ooh, and I should head to the subway. Thanks for listening and remember. Hi there, I'm Simon Krieger, and what you're standing next to is a new form reactor. Once activated, this reactor will supply enough energy to power all of Harlem. Now, I'm sure you're thinking, Simon, how is that possible? And the answer is new form. Just one canister of this revolutionary fuel source is enough to supply Harlem with clean, safe energy for the next 500 years. Soon, we'll be opening reactors throughout Manhattan, and then worldwide. Get ready for a planet powered by Nuvor. Roxxon, we're here for you. What was that? Hmm. No sign of anybody. They broke a bunch of stuff. Maybe they were looking for something. Huh. 
They did a search for new food. What were they gonna do with it? <laughs>
Talking about new form shipments. I need to figure out what they found so I know where they're gonna hit next. They were tracking new form shipments, but why? Rock's on security. They can take it from here. Yeah. Gotta look into this later. 